Hey everybody, welcome to Sugar Free Gaming. This is your host, Shay, and I have a special guest with me today. My, like, decade-long best friend, Vaughn, is here. Yo, what's up? So, Vaughn and I have, like, pretty much grown up together, like, the last 10 or 11 years. So, it's nice to finally have him on the show. Today we are playing Pokemon Snap, which is it's probably going to be really fun doing this together because Vaughn and I grew up on Pokemon. We grew up on Yu-Gi-Oh! Like, this is all shit that's nostalgic for us. Um, he has not played the new Pokemon Snap. Nope. So, I'm excited to hear his reactions. So, we'll, we'll get started. He's going to play, and I'm just going to sit here and watch. Um, so if you go up to research, which is that top one, yeah. So here you get to pick the location you want to go to take photographs. There's like a desert re region, a forest, a beach. Um, we can't get to the volcano? No, I haven't unlocked that yet. And the one that has the explanation point is like places I haven't been to yet. Yeah, so like I haven't been there. Um... All right, this is gonna be fun. I think with this one, if I'm if I'm correct, I think there's a Lugia you can find in here. Oh, hell yeah! <laughs> <laughs> but um, I think it's like sleeping or something. Okay. All right, so I'm trying to remember the controls. I think A is to take pictures, and you can use your like trigger buttons to zoom and shit. Um, yeah, there you go. Okay, cool. We have to get Magikarp since that's the, that was my mascot. Yep. These controls are so interesting. They take some getting used to. Um, your goal is to, like, get a close-up picture of a Pokemon center frame. Um, that's how you get, like, the best scored pictures. And you can, like, do other actions to kind of make the Pokemon do certain poses and shit. Um, but we can, like, focus on that shit later. Just learning the basic stuff's the most important things. Smack dab in the middle. Yeah, that was a good one. Um, this area actually does not look familiar to me, so I don't think this is the Lugia area yet. And I'm is like... Is dead? <laughs> <laughs> Homeboy sleep. I think you can actually photograph some Pokemon, like, getting killed. Like, the very first map, there's a a shot where you can get of, like, a Pidgeot killing a Magikarp. So, there's not really... Oh? Oh? Ooh, Octillery. Here we go. I wonder what, like, the big prize Pokemon of this map is. Ooh, thick boy looking for cheeseburgers. Is that Randy? <laughs> Is that... Oh, look at him. He's just yelling at him. Randy, there ain't no cheeseburgers back here. <laughs> oh, but Mr. Leahy. My food. <laughs> no, I'm saying. Oh. No, I'm saying. Ooh, that Sharpedo's good. That was a good shot. Fucking National Geographic in here. Oh, oh. You can always, like, look behind you as well, because there may be, like, a surprise Pokemon behind you. Is it always slow like this? Yeah. Um. The, oh, that was a fantastic <laughs> shot. I love Sharpedo. I know. Even though he's missing about the half of his body. They missed an opportunity to make him a ghost type. My, uh, Mega Sharpedo from the X and Y days. I miss that shit. Yeah, I like Sharpedo a lot. That speed boost, hidden nature or hidden ability. It'd be cool to see a Raquinids in this. Um, I think there are, or, I think there are some. Yeah, or I'm thinking of Arid Aridos. No, uh, the shit. There's got to be something more to this area than just the quillfish. And the torpedoes. Oh, 
I can't tilt that anymore. There you go. Ooh, that was good. An angry boy. Mr. Leahy just upped his room. Alright, so... Ooh, Tentacruel. I think that's the first time I've seen him in this game. You remember that band episode that they take off with the uh, Tentacruels destroying the city? Yeah. Because it was too, uh, too much like 9-11? <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were gonna talk about the Porygon episode. Nah, you guys want to talk about the uh, the James episode when they uh, get me some uh, cities? cities. <laughs> or the episode where Ga or Gash Ash was held at gunpoint. What's this? Um, that teleports you back to the research lab. Oh. I mean, the Sharpedos are cool. That was cool. There's there's definitely more to that area that we missed, because I don't think we saw the big prize Pokemon. Alright, so now, once you do this, you get to... You get to pick one photo of each Pokemon that you've taken, and pick what you think is the best picture, and then he grades it. So those are all your Sharpedo ones. That one's definitely yeah. the best one. They only took two of the Wilm, or no, one? I thought I got one of them yelling. I got so distracted looking. Man, we gotta get the thick side. <laughs> we have to get the thick side. I got so distracted by all the, the pretty colors and the Pokemon. I didn't get a lot of pictures mm. of them. Also, I haven't played a Pokemon Snap, and this is probably the best picture. That's good, but I don't think that's it. Looks like one of my, my Gundam shots. Why did I get so many angry pictures? If you go back and look at your quillfish picture you selected, um, you got a uh, three out of four star on that one, so that's pretty good. Oh yeah. How do they go about grading it? it they grade it based on the size, um, the action that the Pokemon is doing, and if it's like face on. Like like that one, that one's like directly face on. Yeah. But it it wasn't doing like a unique action, it was kind of just floating there, so that's why they gave you one star. Um, evaluate? Yeah, evaluate. Uh, did I not select one of those? Oh. Alright, so this is where. He kind of goes more in debt on it. So this, on the left side, it will show you my personal best po photo mm -hmm. of that Pokemon. And then it will do like a side-by-side -side comparison to see if it beats my previous one. So you did better by having a second Pokemon show up in the background shot of your magic heart. Yeah. But overall my first one was did better. So you would just leave it on that one. Leave it on this one? Yeah. Nice Alright, so you did better on that course less, so you could change it to that one. It, and with that one being my first time experiencing that Pokemon in the game, that one's automatically going to be the be the one in the slot. Yeah, because you haven't been to this area, right? Correct. I got some dope-ass Pichu pictures. Hey. hey, that was awesome. I like that picture. I like yours a lot, actually. Thank you. Well, you love some Sharpedo. That was a good one. I like that one a lot. It looks like Randy. 
<laughs> I like that one a lot. I like that one too. It looks like you remember the movie cards? Yeah. Or like the episode cards? Yeah. It looks like it'd be one of those so they have a fact about the episode. Before scalpers were a thing? Yeah. For uh, the community? Alright, so... You can kind of skip through all this shit. Like, all this talking shit, it's all boring to me. Um... So now, if you want to go back, we can do, um, yeah, return to camp. Do a different area. We can do a different area, or we can redo the same area, and different things will pop up.